Yes, you mad Etsy people. Hope you guys are well. Guys, one of the biggest complaints, by the way, by customers that buy designs on Etsy is that the quality is not good or it's not what they wanted or it's not what they bought or it's not what they thought it would be. That kind of thing, guys. And part of this is making sure that your designs are upscaled properly. And that's a really, really important thing. You need to make sure that you upscale your designs properly. If you don't upscale it pro properly, then it's going to be pixelated. And pixelated is a problem. But then it's not going to be clear. It's going to be blurry. And you don't want that. You don't want that at all, my. Um, but guys, before I get going to this amazing video, if you love Etsy products, you love creating, researching, listing, and all of that mad, 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 mad Etsy stuff, then please like, subscribe. Smash that notification bell so you get more of my videos in your feed, my. In your feed. Look at this, my. Now, listen, imagine I want to do some designs for um, frame art, right? TV frame art, right? Um, so I've created my design, blah, 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 whatever it is. There you go. Did it on mid journey. Love it. Mm, mm, mm. Um, now there's a few ways you can do this, right? You can obviously just, uh, upscale it in mid journey, which you could do and forex that. But to be honest with you, sometimes it's best to take it into, and it is always pretty much best to take it into another software like Canva or Kittle. Now, my preference would be Kittle. Now, let's say I love this bit of countryside mm, and I want to save it, but I need to upscale it. Like, I'm going to save it as it is first, right? Because at the minute, it ain't upscaled, right? So it's going to be a little bit blurry, a little bit pixelated. You know, 4X is a good number to have, right? And like I said, I could do this in Mid Journey too. But what I like to do is I like to take my designs um, into Kittle, right? Check out free access below. What I like about Kittle is you're all in one. I mean, you all need, we all need the all in one, whether it be Canva or Kittle. But with Kittle, f new features, new things are happening on a regular basis. And I find that Kittle is more suited for us as uh, sellers, for example, uh, on Etsy. It seems like it's better suited because that platform is more designer. It's a more of a designer platform, I would say, uh, than Canva. Although Canva has its amazing uses too. But so if you're going to create a new project, for example, you just go to create new project. Um, and I want to bring in, let's say, a design. Now this can apply to any design. So I just want to show you this feature because some people didn't know that, that Kittle has this feature. Um, so this is what you do. So what I'll do is I'll upload my design, go to upload, click there. Let me see my downloads, click that one, and then I upload it, right? Upload my design. Okay, so let me click on it. Okay, so what's great is I can obviously adjust my canvas size. So I can adjust it here, which is great in, uh, in Kittle. Okay, so I've got my canvas size, my artboard here. So I'm going to upload my, my design, right? And uh, I'll show you in a second because it's, it's, it's really easy. So once you get your design, how you want it. Now, the great thing is about your sizing of your design is with Kittle, you can actually get the right sizing, the exact sizing that you want. Okay, so I've got my design here. And let me just, let me just, let me just go in. Yeah, you can see, look, as soon as I zoomed in, it's, it's just not, it's, it's very pixelated at the minute, right? Very pixelated. And, and that's not going to work, especially when you want to sell these and they need to be on something quite big and the quality needs to be good, right? Um, but like I said, so like I said, what you do is you have various settings here. you got your AI background remover. Again, if you want to remove any background from your designs, this can do it in a click of a button. Um, I do find that this works really well because sometimes there's a bit of residue, but it really does do a great clean. The other thing that this does, it vectorizes. And the thing about Kittle, it vectorizes for real. As in like, it's not just your like, um, you know, it says it's vectorizing, but it's not. It actually does do vectorizing. The other thing is, this is your image upscaler. So if I click on AI image upscaler, literally, I just clicked on it, right? Just just one time. And it will, it will actually... Um, cropped upscale original replaced and saved to uploads right so you can see this with a click of a button look how look how crisp that is i mean i can't i can't stress how cool that looks right from what you saw it just a minute ago it's actually absolutely so so clean right it's upscaling is phenomenal right in a click of a button and that's that's the thing that's what you really need to see look at that i'm going in even even more look at that look at a sheep right absolutely fantastic and this is what I'm saying, you know, when you have a, a sort of all in one, you're able to do everything on a platform rather than spreading yourself thin in terms of like um, buying various software. You really want to cut down on costs by having something that can, let's say, remove a background probably because you need to, which is here. You can scale it up. You can get the right sizing on it. Um, you can create a mock up with it. 
you know, look, there are mock-ups as well here that you can even use for your listings on Etsy. Um, and actually, there are, there are many, many features that Kittle has got, and I will do various tutorials on it. But in terms of this video, I just wanted to show you that there are other options of scaling your designs. And obviously on top of that, not only can you upscale it, but you can also work around and just look at your image and see maybe saturation contrast levels and maybe do a quick, quick adjustment. Um, and you can see like maybe how things can look even slightly better um, or brighter or, or kind of, you know, just full bodied color, um, which is amazing. So you've got that saturation, which you can work with over there, you know, and you can really, really see how, the, the image needs to jump out because one thing I'll tell you with Etsy is that there are hundreds of listings. There are loads of listings on, on pages and the ones that stand out are usually the ones that kind of have something slightly different, whether it be like a new unique design, brighter, things like that. And so the more you can do for your image to stand out, the better. And this can be done through, like I said, various adjustments of color possibly. And also, like I said, mock-ups. And when you actually take your design and you actually use really good professional mock-ups to actually put your designs on, it actually goes a long way. And like I said, Kittle has got an amazing collection of, uh, of, um, of mock-ups. So in this case, let's say uh, TV art, right? So it, it gives you an idea. And guys, I mean, look, aside from just creating a design, um, let's say Mid Journey AI, now you can actually create your whole design on Kittle. So you actually don't even need something like another AI software where you're paying another subscription. I'll give you a quick example. Look, if I wanted to create something on Kittle itself, I could just say English countryside. Let's just look. If you go to um, on the side, you've got something called Kittle AI, right? So I'm going to say countryside. Yeah. So guys, I mean, this is literally, uh, you know, this is your all in one platform where you can literally do everything all in one. And like I said, I'm going to show you more features on Kittle in the future. So it shows you other things that you can do. But like I said, with regards to upscaling, it's got fantastic, it's got a fantastic upscaler. You know, you can test it out. Like I said, test it out. Look at the quality that it does produce. Yes, Mid Journey does have its own upscaler, but let's say you want to create your design on anywhere else, or you can actually create the design on Kittle itself, by the way, and I'll show you a video on that. And you can literally just upscale it and then add those kind of other bits to it where you're brightening up, add a bit of saturation, maybe contrast. Remember, you want to stand out on Etsy. So you might need to add a few of these different adjustments for the color, um, for your designs, just so it jumps out um, and sells on, on, on Etsy. Um, but like I said, there's also other features that you can bring into it where you can produce mock-ups, um, produce your own designs on here. And sometimes you need to add your own text and other things. And the beautiful thing is you can do this all here. But guys, I hope you liked the video. If you did like the video, please hit the like, subscribe, smash that notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care, mate. Take care.